Ogden, Utah Train Museum. This place is sick. I'm supposed to be at a wedding right now. Uh, I lied and said I had to go use the restroom. <laughs> because how can you not check out this stuff? Especially when you're in a Utah wedding and there's no booze. Gotta wait for the hotel to booze it up. 833. Oh, uh, can't get up on them. Look at these things. They got this nice ramp here for you to get up. Oh, look. It's for the Olympics. <laughs> this facility's huge. If you're definitely in Ogden, Utah, come here for $5. There's like all these trains, art museum, car museum, gun museum, art galleries, all for five bucks. Oh, I bet you can get in these during the day if you get a little tour. That's a massive train. I've always wanted to work on trains. so big let's check a look out at these other ones they can go down the other middle line over here I bet people are wondering where I'm at but they're doing their first dance bout now over here because I like trains. This guy. Oh, big old Rio Grande. Wish I had my little phone holder. I don't make too long of a video here. I'm gonna get over here to this Salt Lake City one. For the Olympics, that's pretty cool. Oh, that was for the relay. That's cool. Oh, and there's where the flame was. Up in that bad boy. I see. Oh, more trains. Definitely smells like trains over here. I've been around a lot of trains, you know that smell. The old grease smell. Oh, it's pretty nice today, about 94. They got hidden from the wedding long enough. Time to probably go back. Next excursion will be the gun museum, maybe. We've got like two more hours of this thing. Oh, the fuel. That's where the fuel goes. So much fuel. You can probably fit 80 people in that fuel tank. All right, Union Square, dude. Union Station here in Salt Lake, Ogden, Utah. I keep saying Salt Lake City because I'm an idiot. You got all these big boys over here. You can walk around and chill out. That's it. Check you all out later.